Hey guys, it's Kylan here, back from the KJ Nerds Baseball channel. I know I've not posted in a very long time, it's been almost a year, but um, I am here back and I'm here to tell you guys, there's been a lot of talk about on the internet and YouTube about the Camwood bat. Um, prices range from about $100, but it's similar to a Camwood bat. It, um, a 10 ounce weight, it slides on very easily, fits on most bats. There are a few bats that it does not fit on. For example, a my wood bat. Um, anyway, this thing is it's even cheaper. Prices probably range around ten to thirty dollars. So I I recommend the younger players that need to try to get their bat speed up going into bigger leagues because uh, faster pitchers. Um, you also you also might just need this for just in general to get your bat speed up. I'm going to show you a couple of hits with my uh, weight on and without my weight on. And, and these come in two sizes, a 5 ounce and a 10 ounce weight, depending on. I'm going to be using my Mirchi Cat 8 Drop 10. And so this will make it actually make it 10 minus 10. So that's about a drop 0 ish. So let's see. Okay guys, now I'm going to show you some hits throughout the Easton weight. This is a Moochie Cat 8 again, drop 29 inch, drop 10. I'm just telling you guys what I'm swinging with. Um, take about 4 hits and then I'll switch to the other bat. Hopefully you guys can see some difference in my bat speed. Okay guys, now I'm going to do some hits with the weight on. Very simple to put on, all you have to do is put slide, slide it up. I always like to tap it right here a couple times and slide it back up because then you know it's not going to come flying off, which it won't really, but. Oh, the other thing I like about this is that you can actually, unlike the weights, circle weights that go around the ends of the barrel, these you can on, that you use on, on deck circles, you can actually hit with this on. You can also, um, you do live hitting, you can't use it in a game, but you can do live hitting with it to get your real bat speed up against a real faster, faster pitcher, but you can't use it in a game, like I said. So let's show you guys some hits. As you notice, probably, you can probably see that my bat speed will probably be a little bit slower. That is because of the slower, I mean, the heavier weight. I'll do three more and then take the weight off. Last one. Hey guys, so I just did some hits without it on and with it on. Now I'm going to show you how simple it is to take it off. Sometimes you can bang it like this a couple times and it'll just come right off. Most of the time it's going to be sticking too much. You're going to have to pull. Sometimes it sticks a little bit. But now I'm going to show you some without it. And hopefully you guys can see some change in bat speed. I'll do about three more. One more. And then I'll talk some more. Now I'm going to work on underload overload training where I use an older drop 11 Mako, a drop 10 with a weight on it. Cat 8 Murchi, and then my wood bat, which is a, a drop 8, so overload, underload. 
So, um, I'm going to show you guys some hits with everyone. The style of hitting with using underload or load is very good when you don't have the axe training bat that is overload, underload, axe tra training bat. Um, so, I'm going to show you guys a few hits with every single one. First up is the Mako, which is Roy White, drop 11. Do like three hits with each. Okay, guys, now it's time for my Ruchi Cat 8 with my weight on we got an under load overload train one more Time for my wood Rollins Vivo. This is a drop eight, but to me now it feels really light after doing all the um, underload overload training. One more. Now I'm going to show you, that was my night, nightly routine that I normally do after school every day or later at night. Um, I'm now going to be showing you, this is my game mat for travel. I'm going to be using Cat 8, um, Ruchi, like I told you before in this previous, um, this is uh, my game mat. Unfortunately, I can't use it in, in low league because it's USSA, so you triple, and you have to use USA bats inside um little league and i use a solo in little league so just letting you guys know um it also works on solos the weight does um also yeah i'm just gonna do some hitting hopefully you guys can see more even more improvement Hey guys, I hope you guys enjoyed the video about the Easton 10 ounce weight. They also serve it in a 5 ounce weight. Um, you can, it's the price range is from about 10 to $30, depends where you can find it. Um, I recommend this for a lot of reasons that I explain inside the video. Um, make sure to li like and subscribe and to please leave a comment about other future videos that you would like me to do. See ya.